What would be a cuter addition to your summer barbecue than watermelon cupcakes? This is a treat that the kids will love and the adults will love too. So follow along and I'll show you how to make them. So let's start by making the cupcakes. And you're just gonna make it according to your package instructions. Super easy. This one calls for the mix, water, oil, and eggs. And you're just gonna whisk that up really fast. Make sure the lumps are all out. And now for the fun part. So we're going to take red food dye. You need a little bit more than that. And a little bit of yellow food dye. And this is a trick. The red will still make it red and pinky, but the yellow will make it really vibrant pink watermelon flavor, which is exactly what we want for these cupcakes. So just adding a little bit of that yellow in will make the world of difference. And look at that, it's the perfect pink. And then we're gonna go one step further and we're gonna add these cute little chocolate chips and this is what's going to make it look like seeds. It already looks like a little watermelon. Whoa, it's watermelon! So then just take something to scoop it and add it to your lined muffin tin. And it's seriously so cute already and we haven't even baked them. Lining these just make it way easier. You don't have to worry about greasing them. You pop them right out, add them to a tray. Perfect for a party. And while you're scooping, make sure that each one has some chocolate chips in there so that each watermelon has some seeds. And if it looks like you skimped on any of these, just go back and make sure that they're all full and look good and then you're gonna transfer them to a 375 degree oven for about 15 minutes. You can also stick a toothpick in and make sure that they're cooked through before taking them out. Let's go. While the cupcakes are baking, we're going to add softened butter, vanilla, and start by creaming those together. So once that's all creamed together, we're going to add the sugar gradually in. So once the sugar's all in there, then we're gonna start adding the milk. And you wanna add it slowly until it's the consistency that you like. So just get it going again. And then add a little bit at a time. So the whipping cream has made it nice and fluffy. And then we're gonna add our dye. We have to make them look like watermelon, right? So we're gonna start with green. And again, we're gonna do the same trick that we did with the cupcakes. And we're gonna add a little bit of yellow. And this just makes sure that the color is that perfect shade of watermelon green. And then we're left with this beautiful green frosting, which is perfect for the top of our cupcakes. Check out this color. Isn't that perfect? Ooh, we don't want to lose any of it though. I mean, come on, 
Is this not the cutest thing you've ever seen? It's definitely going to be a hit at your next barbecue. And if you want more recipes, check out Escoffier online or subscribe below.